trading well, you're watching my videos, one of the another to get the entire concept on the chapters. As well as you know that students that on last three videos I have given the important topics from each chapter of your science book. Okay, and today I'm here with a very new and uh, important part throughout your syllabus that is quite important nowadays because based on such type of topics or questions uh, question may occur in your exam paper okay and from my thumbnail i think you already got that based on which points i want to share here okay yes you are fully correct that today i will discuss in this video on few chapters about the hot question or higher order thinking skill questions okay as we know that nowadays such type of conceptual questions comes in exam in a huge manner got it so let's get started without wasting time everyone those who are listening to my video i am requesting you students you please take one uh science copy and a pen okay science copy and pen and whatever question i will say in this video you please note it down by pausing my video okay so that will be better for you please take one copy and pen and start writing the hot style question that may come on different different topics from the chapters okay so let's start chapter one chapter one that is matter in our surroundings matter in our surroundings from here we can easily understand that it is all about the matters and the matters those which are scattered here around us based on that uh, topics it is just elaborated okay so here if the question comes or the hot type question comes so what type of question may come look in matter in your brain matters mainly it is the combination or back figure of the particles of that type of same particles or different particles when it compact or add together okay and makes the figure of it fine so here whatever short question may come look here if i say for based on matter only that what is matter and the characteristics of matters these are the simple question okay the, and we can say that these are the topic based question or in text question whatever but we cannot say this is the hot question hot question means something those which are related, to, or related with our day to day life got it and it is also connected with that very topic got it so here if i say that if the question come in this manner daily basis or uh, if we say that in our kitchen if we observe different type of things or different type of containers are present okay question may occur like this. in your kitchen different utensils or containers are present those which are made up of different metals and the other substances are those a kind of matter what type of matter is this it means homogeneous matter or heterogeneous matter okay then it is asked that what do you mean by homogeneous substances and the heterogeneous substances so it may be a question next if we say for particles based on particles also it can come okay so if the question comes what is particle what do you mean by particle of a substance and what are the characteristics of the particles of a substance so this is the index question so we are not going to read about that and this is as this is the index question we have to think but in a different way so how such question may come question may come in that manner you have a glass in your hand you have a glass in your hand suddenly it fall on the ground or fall on the floor and broke it down after breaking it you have seen that all the small small crystal like structures are scattered everywhere which particle is used here to make the entire glass which particle is used here to make the entire glass so this may be a question again i can say i am giving you a dish made up of iron and a dish made up of stainless steel between these 
which one contains the homologous substances which one contains the heterogeneous substances so as we know easily that iron dish always it contains the iron particles no other matters no other particles are joined here so all so of course the iron dish contains the homogeneous particles whereas the stainless steel it contains the different different particles like carbons like chromium okay like iron so all of those all these things are amalgamated together to make the stainless steel dish so that's why it's a heterogeneous substances okay next if it is said if the other question comes in this way in your surrounding atmosphere is present atmosphere contains several kinds of air is what type of substances substance is this what type of substance is this okay so we can easily say that it's a type of mixed substances or heterogeneous substance what for because in our atmosphere oxygen nitrogen carbon dioxide helium argon xenon radon means all type of gases are mixed together okay that's it now may other other question may come in this way means if i start to say hot question so there will be no ending right so you have to take such type of concept that uh, what type of question may come and those which will must and those which must be related to this topic got it it can be related with the uh, substance like the homogeneous, the heterogeneous, then the matter, then the particles, okay, the characteristics of those things. Then, not only that, but also state, the changes of the state of matter, okay, as we have read the solid liquid gas, got it. So, based on these things, we can also push the WhatsApp question, got it. So, uh, if I say that um, water, water when it is heated so it used to evaporate itself okay it is a very simple time portion but it will not come but you have to take the concept on it so water when it is heated then it is evaporating itself got it so which process it is maintaining which process it is maintaining in the same way in the same way the candle is burning at the time also the entire wax of the uh, candle, it is also evaporating somehow so what type of process is this and what is the difference between this? Okay, so if the question again I am telling the horse question is telling that when water is given to you for boiling, you have seen that water is evaporating as well as when the candle is given to you for burning, the candle is also the wax of the candle is also evaporating. Got it? So what are the processes called? Water the processes for look here the wax of the candle and water is not burning with the same process processes name is different got it in the same way if i say that i am giving you few naphthalin balls okay and i am telling you to burn it or to keep it on the room temperature on the plate on the table after few after a while, you observe that the inter ball of the naphthalene is fully disappeared or vanished from there. How is this possible and what is the process called? But in, in this way, as well as the question may come based on naphthalene balls like this. We used to keep the naphthalene balls inside our almira in between the garments, right? So that the inter fragrance of the naphthalene balls um, can spread it out. Uh, among the garments as well as the garments uh, fragrance of the garments looks very it seems to be very fresh as well as it also helps to clean the germs okay or insects doesn't allow to enter in our almira or the wardrobe got it what process nathalie ball used to do at that very time in our almira so all these processes are under the sublimation process as we know easily that it used to convert from directly from the solid to air okay it used to convert from solid to air so it is under the sublimation process so such process name also you have to understand and you have to keep it in your mind so this type of hot question may come from this chapter one and there is more there is more and let me say you 
Next, if I say for the um, gaseous states, okay, it is completed. Next, <coughs> question will come that you have already heard that the LPG gas and CNG gas are stored in a cylinder. Got it? So it is common, it is everywhere, you, you know about it. So when LPG gas like butane gas as well as the component the CNG gas is stored in the cylinder. So when we jerk the cylinder, it seems to be the liquid. So how is this possible that the conversion of the gas into liquid? How is this possible? So which process it is maintained here? We know that this is a kind of convection process. It means the huge process, the huge pressure it is providing on the gas like butane and uh, uh, CNG gas it is given the high pressure on it as well as by reducing the temperature of it okay temperature comes in or temperature is released from the air like butane and the CNG as well as this given pressure to it in a huge amount so that the inter particles of the air it used to combine together and makes a loose compact among them and becomes to, and becomes the liquid from there okay so that's why uh, by the compression by the compression process the LPG gas or the CNG gas is stored in a cylinder and that's why it is it looks like water okay and it also feels like water inside the um, cylinder that's it so such type of portion may come fine next uh, if I say yes another thing it's a very important portion may come look from one chapter how many horse portion may occur Next, if I say uh, that we know in our body, in our body, the normal temperature is 70 degrees centigrade. Okay, we never people you, uh, people seems the high blood pressure or low blood pressure at that time they feels very weakness into themselves, right? So how is this possible? How do the blood pressure? How do blood pressure uh, occurs in our body in a high or low range? Got it? It is only the based on the circulation of the blood. The circulation of the blood in our body. How is this possible? When people used to go for thinking in a deep manner or when people used to go for depression for a long period of time. Okay, all these matters used to give a pressure on in our circulation of the blood, means in our entire body. Okay, so when such a pressure means a depression or absurd minded or excessive happiness okay so all these extreme matters when it affects on our body so mainly it affects on our heart and that's the time our heart is to pump rapidly then it's normal vibration okay so when our heart is to move rapidly at that very time the entire bloods also move in that very force okay a huge force is to operate our body so that's the time it seems that our body gets huge pressure by the circulation of the blood and then the high blood pressure is to occur as well as when sometimes our body gives so much absurdness okay so much depression that excessive depression at that very time also the movement or the uh, rapid vibration of the uh, heart it used to lose somehow okay it gets loose i'm not telling stop then people will get tired okay i'm telling that it used to vibrate and lose uh, lose it okay it gives a loose impact on it and that we time also for uh, the blood throughout our uh, vesicles it used to move in a very uh, low force okay and it circulates but the force not like that force doesn't appear look like that so at that very time people also get very very weakness in themselves so such such a question may come then we know that so this is the kind of question next the other question may offer that we know in each type of or in each state of matter, it contains a kind of heatness in it. Okay, or the question may come in uh, like that. Suppose an ice cube is given to you. Suppose an ice cube is given to you. You have kept it on the table. You have kept it on a plate, and then using the thermometer, you have seen that or centigrade thermometer, seen that the temperature is showing on the ice cube that is zero degree centigrade. Now, I told you to keep that ice cube along with the plate on a table. After a while, you observe that the inner ice cube has molded itself and becomes the water, the full water of the dish. Okay, it turns into water. There's solid particles of the ice. Again, I'm telling you to put the thermometer into the water. 
to take the measurement when you are taking the thermometer again to the water and you see that it comes as zero degree how is this possible okay so when it was in a ice cube that time it shows the zero degree again when it turns into water that time also it is showing the zero degree so how is this possible so where the temperature has taken or absorbed here how is this possible so the answer will be it is only possible because of the kinetic energy what energy kinetic energy you all know about it okay so kinetic energy helps to take the actual temperature in that substance when it is changing its property property is not it is changing its shape okay but when the ice cube has changed its shape at that time it has also absorbed the temperature from the outside means the external temperature is taken but it hasn't taken in a huge quantity it has taken a very small quantity the external temperature has taken a very small quantity and that was enough for that ice cube to mold it to melt itself but it so that's why it is under the kinetic energy with how it has happened it has happened only because of the kinetic energy that is present that was present in the ice cube okay that's it next question may come in the kitchen when your mother is going to prepare tea okay at first she has poured the water into the container after that after a while you observe that the lower the the most lower part of the container from there bubbles are coming out okay from the control through the lower part of the container the bubbles are coming out from there and after that gradually the bubbles are moving around the water how is this possible this is also based on the kinetic energy when the water has poured into the container the hot container and it was still now it is burning at that time the kinetic energy was increasing itself the kinetic energy was increasing into the water as the temperature is increasing from the external side as well as the kinetic energy also was increasing into the molecules of the water okay and the kinetic energy was increasing so lot at that time the molecules of the water was just vibrating into itself was moving into itself here and there but it, and after that once it came it starts boiling what for because the 100 degree centigrade that was needed by that water it has already absorbed by the water okay from the outside from the burner but it, at that time the kinetic energy was reduced and the potential energy was moving in a rapid manner in a continuous manner or frequent uh, continuous is constant manner and that's why the water was boiling itself so this is the answer so in this way you have to give the answer that's it next if i uh, give the question on evaporation look evaporation is a very simple topic question what type question may come in different way if i say that you know after washing clothes, it's also already given in your book, telling again. After washing clothes, uh, we used to rinse it well and we give it on a rope under the sunlight. And after after a few minutes or after an hour, observe that the entire washing, the uh, wash or wet clothes turn into dry clothes. How is this possible? Only because of the evaporation process. Next, uh, we know that. Um, we know about the sea breeze and land breeze. Okay, question may offer that during the summer season, we most of the time, we most of the time uh, make a plan for visiting to the nearby sea or near, uh, yes, nearby sea. But we used to visit nearby sea. What is the matter? We do not go for mount, uh, we do not go for hills, hilly regions, but we used to prefer the sea regions. What for? This is also a kind of thing. What for? Because during the daytime, during the daytime, as the uh, as the sunlight is falling on the water and as well as the land as well, okay, the land gives heat more faster than water. Okay, so that time the air of the um, from the land it used to it becomes lightweight and it moves towards the sky. And to fill up this gap, to fill up this gap, the cold air rushes to that many place. Okay, so that's why people get relief during the summer season by uh, reaching to the coast areas okay coastline areas as well as during the night time during the night time also when the uh, land becomes cold okay it becomes colder more than the hot than the water 
So at that very time, the water used to move towards the water, the hot water, the hot air, the hot evaporation. It used to move towards the sky from the water side, and then the heavy cold air it used to move in the um, land areas. Okay, so that's why at the both time in during the summer season we are getting the cold air. So uh, in the summer season people prefer the coastline areas. Okay, so that is the matter of the evaporation. Next, if I say um, yes. Why do we prefer cotton clothes? Why do we pre prefer cotton fabrics during the summer season? You know it, I will not say. So such question may come then if I say for the last topic. Okay, last topic. Okay, another topic. Another question based on this evaporation. That we know that during the summer season, during the summer season or, or in, in any season, in the deserted area, it must not get the excessive or sufficient rainfall. Rain doesn't happen there at all simultaneously in few cases, few years. Okay, so how do the cactus, how do cactus to stay there in a like manner as well as you other type of organisms, new organisms are also present over there. How is this possible? Okay, so such may offer. Then the last part is plasma and most of time condensed. From there, one question may come that um, nowadays we are using LED lights. Okay, nowadays we are using LED light everywhere. What for? What is the reason behind it? Okay, mainly in LED lights, what type of ray is taken? Okay, or noble gas is taken? Got it? Next, in uh, street lights, people are using the neon uh, neon gas. What is the benefit of using the neon gas over there in the light? So such questions are very very important and these are the hot questions from chapter 1. Uh, students hope I have helped you somehow by saying such questions. You please rewind this video again and again to get all the questions because along with my explanation and uh, you can say uh, along with my deliberations I have told in between many questions. Got it? So you please take out all those many questions only by, by the help of your concept that this may be a question. So please write it down by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in that manner. So your voice and write down the answer in yourself. Okay. And if possible, send me the answers through my email ID. Email ID is given there. You please observe it and write it down and send me accordingly. Okay. Hope you are getting uh, the entire concept from chapter 1. On the next video, I am coming with the concept of chapter 2. The hot style question from chapter 2. Till then. Bye bye, stay well, read well and practice well, you all will be succeed.